All right, dudes and dudettes, today we start our all the modium journey. It's gonna be lit. All right, so the first things first is we need to get a builder and I do believe, yeah, this does need all the modium in our nuggets. So what we wanna go ahead and do is I, let's see, this is fortune, yes. Um, in our first video, we found some all the modium in a cave over here, I believe. Um, so I'm gonna see where the coordinates were for that uh, first clip and we'll be right back. Okay, from what the video that I created says, we should have one literally right here if we did straight down. Uh, now we did end up losing the world that I made the uh, waypoint in, but I, we have the coordinates on screen, so hopefully this gets us to it. And if we look here at the coordinates, negative 42 is where we should be able to go. Okay, I forgot we have vein miner in this. So yeah, we can just mine. Straight down. Oh my. Well, that's fortunate. Wait, hang on. Shapeless. No, come back. And we got seven. Nice. No, it's not here. Wow, this looks crazy. I'm going to mine this guy. Oh man, that's a bummer. Thought I had a for sure way of finding all the modium. All right, I guess I'll be looking. Okay, I've located another deep dark here. Um, let's break this scope shrieker. All right, come on. I've got the, the Morgan Freeman here. All right, there he is. Where is he? Can he take on Morgan Freeman? Where is he? I think he's over here somewhere. Trying to get him to come out. Yes. <gasps> oh, we just three shot the hornet. Holy crap. <laughs> that is awesome. Let's go. Withers Compass. Okay. What do you do? War, uh, Warden Carthopasis. Reinforced Echo Shard. Oh, wow. Okay, so you can upgrade netherite tools. That's cool. So we just destroyed the warden. Um, zombie. <coughs> okay, so that's the warden. It was fun. Still looking for Osmodium. It only spawns in deep dark. Which is okay. Oh my gosh, that terrified me. Okay. Oh! That just smacked me pretty good. Is this it? Ugh, gold ore, come on. Yes! Here we go, all the modium. Okay. All right. So we should be able to double that. So we have a total of eight, all the modium, which means we do have enough to build our things. I would ideally like to have one more, maybe. Yeah, that's gonna do it. 
bro is blasting me from under the rocks. Ah, this isn't fun. He's hardly doing anything, which is kind of funny. Okay. Well, he can spawn in. Yep. There you go again. Being dumb. I didn't even move. What do you mean? Oh, sorry, turtle. Yes. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and double the ores that we're getting. I did go ahead and set up the filter already. Yep, so we should see all the modium dust here, which is gonna be sweet. Oh yeah, all the modium. So we should get quite a bit. So yeah, we got those. We even got a ROM. Oh, we got one more. Very cool. Okay, so we're up to seven. We're gonna be eight, nine. Nice. Let's go. Very good. Okay, so we're gonna make a teleport pad because that'll allow us to get a lot of these guys. And yep, there we go. We have 12 total. Awesome. So we're gonna convert that into some ingots. That actually should be enough for the builder and the teleport pad. All right, builder, got it. Wow, okay. There it is, teleport pad. It's important to remember that if you break this, it is gone. Um, I think I'm gonna put ours here. Put the stand on it. Sneak right click with both hands empty to teleport. Oh, okay. There we go. All right, and this is the all the modium dimension, which is sweet. I'm gonna mark this here. And there's not really a whole lot to explore here. Um, I don't think any generation, like any structures generate here. Great place to find Batania flowers if you're looking for those. Um, but yeah, we need to make a all the modium potion and then we can build this. And then we can mine it or look for it, I guess. So we'll need a brewing stand. Um, all the modium power, here we are. We can make that. And then uses, we smelt it. All right, and then uses for this guy. Mundane. We can use blaze powder for that, okay. All right, there we go. All the modium site. Now we're gonna combine this with the blaze powder. And there we go, we now have a charm of all the modium sight. So we don't have to drink a potion, we don't have to worry about that, we just have it. Okay, so we have the all the modium sight. Actually, I wanted to try one thing out. Um, I believe we can make some all the modium seeds here. Ooh, insanium block. It takes nine of those. That is a very efficient way to craft essence. So I'm gonna bring this over here, and uh, I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I set up a bunch of garden cloches with inferium seeds in it, and we now have 173,000 inferium. So that should be enough to go ahead and create that. So all we gotta do is just click this a bunch of times. Okay, we've got a little bit of inferium essence. I think this is about 20,000. My frame rate has gone to complete crap. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we're gonna load all this up.
Jeez, that was a lot. Okay, so now we're going to do these a bunch of times. Okay. So now we have a metric hecton of Inferium blocks. And the cool thing is, is all we need is the crystal and we can convert these nine at a time up to Predidutium, however you say that. So we are putting a massive amount of this stuff. Oh my. Oh my, we, <laughs> holy crap, that was all of our, oh my gosh, okay. Well, one, two, three, four, and then we need seeds. Oh my gosh, okay, so we made it, and we have so much left over as well. So let's see, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Wait, did that not work? Oh, all the modium blocks. Holy crap. Okay. Well, I guess we're not going to be able to do that. We do need to mine up. So four blocks. That's 36. All the modium. And we have 10. Okay. So. I have a couple of pickaxes here um, that we're going to go mining with. We have Actually, we have some netherite ones, too. I want to keep our fortune three... Um, over here. Yeah. Breaks a three by two area. Cool. So that's exactly what we want. Uh, so I guess, oh, we need some torches too. Yes. And we're gonna look for some all the modium. Oh wait, we gotta get that out real quick. Nice. I believe we should go down a bit. Oh, there we go. Found some Aldemodium. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. So we switch over. Actually, we get our backpack out. Okay, so now we can mine this. I don't think it likes vein mining. So now we're up to eight. Wow, we have we have quite a, a bit around us, which is good. Okay, so we switch here. Um, Good, we're up to 11, which means we are almost there. I think we only need to mine a couple more and we're we set. And there we go, we have enough. All right, so we're gonna throw these guys in here. So now we're gonna get 50. All right, so now that we have 36 all the modium ingots, we now have four blocks of all the modium. So now we can make the all the modium seeds. Booyah! Look at that. All right, all the modium seeds. That is crazy awesome. Okay, so in order to use all the modium seeds, we have to make this here, which is magical soil, 
which is more Insanium uh, plus Dragon Scale and an Insanium Farmland. So we, believe it or not, are actually really close. We can make that pretty easily. I'm going to use this. We're going to turn that off. And yes. We're going to bring a whole bunch of Inferior Essence over. Maybe even more this time. Okay, so I figured I'd make this really easy for us this time and just connect it straight up to the network here so we should be able to see, yes, that's gonna be so much easier to make this time. We don't have to lag out the world. So I'm just gonna be here, click a whole bunch of times and we'll be right back. All right, so I have used up every single ounce of um, inferior essence we had there. If you're wondering guys, that's just a storage bus. You just connect it up to the network and any outside storage device um, will link up to it. I'm actually not sure of any, but majority of them. So yeah, that can start going again. And yeah, so now we have all of that uh, essence here. We have 15,000. That is crazy. Now we're gonna turn all of this into all of the essence we can really. Ooh. All right, so I think we had just over two inventories full. All right, ooh, perfect amount. All right, we made 15 of these guys this time. Very cool, okay. So, now that we have this, we can use that to make farmland. Good. And now we need to make the, we need the dragon scales. Yep. Okay, let's go make the farmland for our all the modium stuff. So the farmland goes in the middle, and then one, two, three, four, two, three, four. There we go. Magical soil. That's awesome. All right, magical soil. One times the speed, but unobtainium. Okay, so we're gonna need to fight the dragon a couple of times, but that should be everything we need for our seeds. Very good, and I don't have anything here. So soil and that, and boom! So that gives us one in the um, botany pot, but it gives us two in the garden cloche. So yeah, we have now automated all the modium. That's crazy cool. Now let's see, how much do we have left? We have 10 ingots. Wow, very cool. What can we use with these 10 ingots? Um, I think we need to make a pickaxe, honestly. That should really be our next priority. Um, yeah, our pickaxe. Okay. Mm, does it have to be two? Oh, it has to be that one. Okay. One, two. I think we're going to have the perfect amount to make a pickaxe. Yeah, we have the perfect amount left over for a pickaxe. Oh yeah, all the modium pickaxe. That means we can do some other things. Oh, teleport pad. Oh, we got an all the modium ingot. Oh, and we potentially got more. Let's see, what do we get? Nice, we got three more. We got a gun. What? Nice. That's gonna be weird. Let's see. Who is this from? Are they... Jeez. Oh. I know you could kill him. Okay. Well, that's our gun.
All right, so let's work on the builder now. Um, let's see here. The builder's from RF Tools, right? All right, so we want a clearing quarry. Ship card clearing quarry. Okay, and then we need this guy. So we just need a guy in the middle. Booyah. Quarry, and then uses. Clearing quarry. Okay. So yeah, we need to set this up in the nether. Need a flux point. There we go. Okay, so let's head into the nether. And we need to find a biome. Oh, that's right, I had the, the portal in that place. So we need to find the biome where the trees are green. Um, I've done a bit of exploring here. I think we need to go this way. Where are we now? We're here. Okay, so we need to hang a right. To go northeast. Okay, yes, this is the biome here. Um, I believe, unless they've changed it. Yeah, Warped Forest and Crimson Forest. We need to go up to Y level 100. Okay. So, Builder. Um, on the back, we'll give this power. We need to limit it. Um, transfer limit. Like in 2000. So we'll say 1000 is our limit for this. Okay. So we're going to set a waypoint. We're just going to set a waypoint. And then we're going to chunk load this. Okay, slash home for now. And let's get a trash can. All of the stuff that we want is being currently uh, created. Like quartz, stuff like that. The only thing we want is the vibranium. So we need it solid. We'll try 50 by 50 by 23 and then we can void this gravel okay solid there we go okay so that's mining that's only minus uh 1000 yep so even though it says it doesn't have enough power It's gonna work, it's just working slow. We're not letting it take all of the power out of our system so that we have other things that we can do. Okay, so I guess I'm just gonna go AFK here for a bit and we'll be back. Okay, so it's right here. found one yet. We're still in the warped forest. Hmm. I mean, it's moving pretty quick. Let's have a look here. Vibranium. Okay. Do, do, do. Y100 to Y21. Okay. Warped forest and crimson forests. Okay, so we just have to let this go for a bit. And hopefully it finds it soon. Only going up to Y110. So we need to offset it by 13. So we can stop. Offset by 13. I think it's starting over here again. Yeah. 
Okay, this is way better. So this is going to be the top at where it can spawn. And because it's only set for 23 blocks, it's not going to mine all the way down here. It's going to mine to essentially right here. This will be the new bottom right here. Uh, that's creepy music. So cool. Okay. Now we wait more. I kid you not. I kid you not. I was literally looking for where the stupid quarry was, and I found a bunch of it. Um, yeah, we're gonna go to Shapeless. We, we need this guy. Yeah, I was mining for it, and we found some. So we'll be able to make a potion, hopefully. Oh wait, I need this. Yeah, I don't want to lose it. Oh, right. He doesn't like it when we do that. I need to enchant this guy. Make it have efficiency on it. There we go. Vibranium ore. Perfect. Dang. I feel like now our quarry was literally a waste. I've been sitting there for hours. It's been about two and a half hours and I haven't found anything. I'll show you guys where it was popping before but yes um we're gonna go down here and we're gonna break these two we will put the filter for that so it doesn't take it and then we can put it here okay so let's make some uh some vibranium powder stiff this guy here um yep we can make it good so then we're gonna take uh, this and smelt it um, and then we're gonna get some water bottles. Ooh, we need some glass. That brewing. And then we have the calcinated vibranium powder. Okay, and the vibranium powder goes in. All right, we have the vibranium site. So we're gonna combine these together to make the charm. Cool. Also, while we're here, let's see if we can get fortune on our all the modium pickaxe. Oh my gosh, it was the first one. Holy cow. Okay, that's really going. Fortune three, efficiency four, soulbound and teleportation. I know I'm not really the biggest fan of teleportation, but I'll be okay with the fortune three and efficiency four. That's for sure. Okay, so if we click this on, yes, person. Huh, this is at Y level 92. And Y level 100 to 123, so it's wrong. We just found one that spawns lower than the limit it said that it was. Okay, I think the important thing is to just look for it. And it seems to almost spawn in patches. It looks very similar to the wood itself. Up to 18, which means we have something, 36. Which means we need a little bit more because I want to automate the seeds too. All right, so here's the quarry space. I've changed it to uh, 512 by 512, the maximum. And yeah, we're not even close. Hmm. Oh yeah, we are close actually. We had one. Thirty-three, so we got over a stack. Oh wait a second. Got a few here. Yeah, this is below the limit that it said. Hmm. Forty-one. Yeah, look at this. This one's below ninety. Oh. Forty-two. How low do these go? Oh my. That's even lower. 
This is why level 73 and 72. it's spawning way more frequently the lower we're going okay well at least we found some all right full stack so we got a full stack of those guys uh i also put this elevator here which is really handy so actually i think we already put vibranium in here i'm just gonna double check yeah okay we're gonna process up all of this raw vibranium and yeah that one's that one's done so now oh now it's super fast to get up here which is sweet let's turn this guy off good and we're gonna come down here for charcoal Perfect. So I'll let this process up and we'll be right back. All right, that makes two stacks of vibranium, which is super cool. So we don't need to go into the nether for a while. Um, so we have the charm. What we need to do is make the pickaxe. Um, let's see. Actually, do you have to make a, a pickaxe for that? Huh, unobtainium ore. It's found in End Highlands. I think I need to go grab the builder, actually. Okay, so you don't actually need... Um, you don't need like a, a, another tier pickaxe or anything like that. So we can we can mine unobtainium with our pickaxe. So we need to go to an end highlands. And if you guys remember last episode, we actually found one in end highlands. Yes. So we're going to set up a build quarry here. Uh, you can stop. And we're going to max this out. Um, we'll just say zero, 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 void that. We don't need to void gravel. Okay. And then let's do a preview. Hmm. I, is that the bottom? Wow. Huh, there are Endermen spawning on this. Okay, so it's definitely not this way. It's because we were at 600. Yeah. Okay. Maybe we bring that down just a little bit. Okay, yeah, so that's where I want it. I don't want it to even risk tearing up um, the waystone. There we go. Go, and we will start. We're gonna start off in the northeast corner. So let's see if we can find it. Oh my, what a marvelous time. Look over here, I finally found where the dang quarry was and look what it found. That's right, unobtainium, which is now obtainable. <laughs> Raw unobtainium ore. Um, I should have some kind of block I can put here. Yes. I don't want to stand on it because it falls. And we do have a magnet on, so we get it. Perfect. Look at that. Seven. Ah. Oh. This is cool. <laughs> this is what I want. Okay, so we're gonna need some bees. That's okay. 
but we are almost we are here we can make this oh my oh my oh my um I'm, we're gonna uh process this stuff up add an obtainium throw it in there Mm-mm-mm. Unobtainium. Let's freaking go. And it even gave us some. Okay. Okay. Oh, we got some more. We can process that up. Uses. We're just going to place it down and break this guy. And there we go. We got a total of 16 of these guys. Oh my gosh, that's fantastic. So we also got a bunch of coarse fruit too. Oh my goodness. So we're going to make one of these guys. We're going to smelt it. And we're going to find some more unobtainium. So that we can make seeds for it. We might need to fight the Ender Dragon one more time. That's okay. Oh, yeah. All right. The unobtainium powder goes in. And booyah. Unobtainium site. Next, we mix it with the blaze powder, just like normal. And boom, now we have this. So that means we come over here, we go back to the end highlands. Right, we turn it on. It's taking a while to load, that's okay. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that. All right, that's more than a stack, so we're gonna go ahead and head home. Wow, our journey. For all the modium ores is done. We have enough to um, we have enough to create the seeds for each of them. Uh, however, I don't think we have enough dragon scales, uh, so we're gonna have to respawn the dragon one time, and then we'll be able to automate the production of them. But yeah, it's uh, it's working really good. Oh, one thing we need to do is all the modium essence. I just realized we didn't set that up. Um, I believe it's over here. Yeah, okay. So click here, uses. Oh my, we're gonna do that. Internal. Okay. And then we have to do uses here, external shebang. Okay, so we have our first automated all the modium ingot. Um, yeah. And then our unobtainium is going. So let's make those. Yeah, we can make all of them into seeds now. Four. Perfect. Four. Look at that. Okay. So we have enough. Okay, and then we're gonna grab two prosperity seeds. Okay. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four, and then the seeds. Oh yeah, unobtainium seeds. Excuse me. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. We'll turn this guy off. Perfect. So a quick 
Ender Dragon fight, and we can craft up the farmland to go ahead and put these guys on. But that's going to wrap up the episode for today, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all so much for watching. Next episode is going to be crazy. We're going to be getting a time in a bottle, which is probably one of the most overpowered items in the game. Rivals the overpowerfulness of the Morgan. So anyways, dudes and dudettes, thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you next episode. Take care. Peace out. Bye-bye.